what has happened down here is the wind have changed. Clouds roll in from the north and it start to rain. Rain real hard and rain for a real long time. Six feet of water in the streets of Evangeline. Louisiana. Louisiana. They're trying to wash us away. They're trying to wash us away. Louisiana. Louisiana. They're trying to wash us away. 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 We're putting this thing together for all the networks again. Right. Uh, to raise money for uh, the victims of the hurricane. All six networks are on board for this show. It's ABC, it's CBS, it's NBC, it's Fox, it's WB, it's UPN. And those are the celebrities right now, but they're not all... See, i got to change the board, because okay. some of these people will be in New York, like uh, Chris Rock Chris. is in New York, Morgan Freeman is in New York, so I should do, do like a New York celebrity, L.A. celebrity thing. Okay. Paul Simon will start off, I think, just him on acoustic guitar, but then he'll be joined by Wynton Marsalis and a New Orleans brass band. I talked to Rod about it an hour ago, and uh, I, I tell you, this guy is, uh, he's very excited too. I think this could be a very unique performance. And the idea, just so you know, what we were always imagining, is it's actually, Rod is obviously the lead singer. He does a version of People Get Ready different than how the Persuasions did it, but what we want to do is get a really great vocal arranger in there to work and sort of combine the two arrangements. There's rumblings about doing a remote the night of our show from Toronto. <sighs> okay. With a band called U2. A little band called U2? Yes. Okay. What could we do? We're going to make it her thing. I think she'll take this to church. That sounds beautiful. It sounds amazing. I mean, so you're saying you'll you but you will sing with her or or uh, yeah. So you got you'll just make it like a duet all the way through you're saying. It's a very racially charged situation and it's very important that we show you know some sort of grace here. So I think putting us in a in kind of supportive role with Mary is just about the best thing um, for everybody. Putting it along with her and um, by doing that I think we contribute best to the situation, to the program, and to, you know, what's in it for us is, you know, we want to do something that's memorable, you know, that's it. We don't just want to play a song, so. What a great idea, what an inspired idea, man. We're taking some production risks and, you know, running around here, not quite organized. We're doing that because um, you're in charge, and we know um, uh, where you park your car. Know <laughs> where you park your car. Oh my God, I don't even know what to say about that. I wish I could be in Toronto, but I will be there in spirit, and I will. I have really, I have really good people working with your people, so. I, always, I know. But when, no, no, it's great. So, so relax, and uh, well, at least don't relax, and we'll see you later to relax. All right, Bob, I'll try to get some sleep before tomorrow. Bye, bye, bye. Alright, thank you. Uh, my role was basically, I was, you know, one more uh, person watching television and just feeling that uh, there weren't enough people there. And, and so it became very easy to get out, to, 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 for me to get there and get a boat, to get out on the water uh, with some other people and try to get people out of the water. Hello? Joe? Yo! Hey, man, it's Keith and Steven. Hey, Keith, hey, Steven. How you doing, uh, Joel? How you doing? I'm so I'm good. I'm just I'm watching the show with the family on uh, on on what happened. Uh, it's fucking horrific. You know, this was a day after, and the winds had died down. And you could see the people on the bridges, right? And the babies and people dying in front of you, and bodies floating by, and and you know there. Uh, it's just it was such a shame that that nobody just said that's it, fuck it, let's get all the surrounding towns, get the helicopters in. I mean, even Woodstock, 40 years ago, 30 years ago, we dropped hot dogs. I, it, I, it's just, it's, it was a very, very, very late reaction. And, uh, so, Joel, what are you thinking of doing here? We're, what we're trying to do is, uh, is, is sort of get a, you know, a very strong message across, but a very simple message. And obviously we want to 
attract as many people to pick up the phone and, and make donations and, yeah. and, and, and help rebuild the city. As I'm sure there are a lot of local telethons and a lot, a lot of local fundraisers, but this is the one that, that has the best chance to have the most maximum impact and seen by the most you know, amount of people. And so obviously being that it's this kind of show, as we did it four years ago after 9-11, we want the music to be the driving force. Plus we have a bunch of celebrities, starting with Ellen DeGeneres through Morgan Freeman, you know, Chris Rock, Jack Nicholson, and a handful of others that will do little talks between the songs to help drive people to, uh, to donate. And uh, so, you know, obviously, you know, for, for you, for Aerosmith, we were trying to think of what would be a great, great, great idea. And the one that we keep coming back to, are you ready for this one? I can only imagine. Don't want to miss a thing. Sweet emotion. No, 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 no. Uh, no, I was thinking more of a, a cover. So, uh, something like Born on the Bayou. Wow. I mean, that was just a thought because it just, I, we listened to the way Fogarty sang it. I just felt like... <laughs> You could sing the shit out of that, and Joe could play the guitar on it, and you could play harmonica on it if you wanted. It'd be nice if there was a couple places in the show where we rocked out, but appropriately. Yeah. And that, that's like a very proud song about growing up in this area. Well, I, I want to do this so bad. I mean, even if I have to do it myself with somebody. What's going on with the band? The band's not around? Oh, no, they, they are. It's just going to be a bit, you know, it's going to be, I'll have to, you know, just, we'll, we'll, we'll get them together. And okay. It's just making sure we're not, we don't suck. Oh, of course, no, yeah. We gotta learn the song. Oh, I see what you're saying. You need to not only find them, you have to get together with them and rehearse it. That's what you're Absolutely. talking about. Oh, right, of course. And what it's am I? All day Wednesday and Thursday, that's all. That should be enough. It's, uh, it's Creedence Clearwater. That's right. <laughs> Don't you think Starbucks should be donating lattes to the cause? I think so, yes. Hi, I yeah. Yeah. Let's get, let's get Seattle on the phone. <laughs> Here's what happens last night, Jack. All of a sudden, I get this email. It just says, here you go. Okay? It's from, it's from Prince's to Guitar Tech, right? Doesn't say anything else. Okay? And this is what's on there. Certainly not the ones who don't want to repent And keep giving guns To the poorest of our nation's sons Who is gonna call you by name? So, so what happened was, um, I wrote back, I just got this amazing song you just sent me, he should do it on the show, right? I replied, did he just write this in the last few days? To which he replied, a few days? He just finished it about 20 minutes ago, and he started on it about five hours ago. Perhaps he's watching television, and perhaps he's moved by the whole thing. Obviously, it inspired him to write a song. I said, well, am I holding a spot for him? And I have the perfect Mariah Carey song if you want to throw it to her. Can we hear it? It's called Through the Rain. And who sang it? Mariah Carey. Oh, right. Her single. On her last album. It's like she, it's like she wrote it for this. Yeah, it's, it is now on the head. Is it too nailed on the head, though? I don't know. Listen to it. Can you also, Charlotte, can you download the lyrics for me? Yeah. Oh, my God. We just listened to it, and we all had chills. It's, uh, it's lyrically... I thought it was going to be too perfect, yeah. but, but it's actually lyrically perfectly appropriate and emotional and inspirational. It's wow. it's almost as it's almost as perfect as Hero was when she yeah, when she did that, that when, when she did the 911 moment. Wow. It's on it's on it's on the fucking money, man. Out of the park. I, I just got a little goose pimply when you said that too, Joel. Martha Stewart wants to do our show. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, documentarians don't laugh. Yeah, I'm sorry, Joel. Is Alicia Keys, just Alicia Keys on the piano, Alicia Keys with a gospel thing. Lenny Kravitz wants to do something. What about a duet between Bonnie Raitt and Kelly Clarkson? I'm dead serious. Really? Of course, thanks. That's 
15 to 15 to draft. Take 15. I think it's Jennifer? That's me. Hi, it's Joel Gallen. How are you? Okay. Thank, Thank you. Thank you so, so much for doing this. Absolutely. Uh, anyway, here's what we wrote for you. Uh, throughout the Gulf Coast, no one was safe from the storm. But no one was more vulnerable than the premature babies who were clinging to life in hospitals across the region. All across the Gulf Coast, some babies are still separated from their parents and other babies will never see their parents again. These children will need a lifetime of support, support you and I could begin to provide right now. Please help. Well, that's beautiful. It's, you know, and it's, it's, it was just like a first pass, but we can certainly... No, it's beautiful. Hi. What's going on? Who's that? Who's that? He I mean... is gorgeous. <laughs> You're here to help? Are you a volunteer? I just wanted to check in with you and uh, think, uh, talk about what you're thinking about uh, song-wise uh, for the show Friday. Well, um, it was between um, this new song I have called uh, Touch the Sky. Uh, uh, which uh, inspirational, or of course Jesus walks. So we could get like um, a gospel uh, choir to actually do an acapella, and maybe I do it well, with no drums, which could be very emotional. We could we could maybe do that. I mean, we we've talked to the House of Blues. They they've called us and said they have like every good gospel choir in town. They have access to. Um, we might be able to help uh, put that together. Now, Kanye, let me ask you another question. Tomorrow, I'm going to get on the phone with the head of all uh, um, six networks, okay? And I'm going to go through the whole show with them, both in New York and L.A., and I know they're going to ask me, do you think Kanye is going to uh, say something similar to what he said on the NBC show? What, what should I tell them? Oh no! I just performed the song. That's what I'm gonna. That's what I thought. They just want to make sure it's all about just raising money, and 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 getting as much help to these people as possible. Yeah, I understand the ramifications of it. My goal is for it to be positive and and to raise as much money and help as many people as possible. And I understand it can have negative ramifications also. And I didn't mean to like pinpoint Bush at all, you know. No, totally. Okay, just had to ask the question. You understand? And I appreciate the honest answer. Um, listen. Uh, who's like packing everything up so I want to get over there? It's all going to be there. Um, I have. You know what I'm saying we need the boom box. We need all these CDs. We need everything okay. to be to be like raced over there. I don't know if as soon as we leave, it's got to sort of go at the same time. Hello. I got we got to relocate soon to the to Sony. Does that I, Charlotte? How's everybody going to know the phone number of where we're at? When we leave here, can we forward our phone number there? We have the two old phones. Our phones are too old to be able to do that. Our phones are too old. They can't do that. Rundown. This is impressive. Awesome. We got Randy Newman, Ellen DeGeneres, U2, Mary J. Blige, Morgan Freeman, into Alicia Keys, into Cameron Diaz, into Neil Young, Chris Rock, into the Foo Fighters, Jennifer Aniston, into Mariah Carey, Chris Willis, into Paul Simon, Seal Ward, into the Dixie Chicks, Don Cheadle, into Cheryl Crow, 
Jack Black into Rod Stewart and the Persuasions. Ray Romano into Kanye. That's a segue. Hello. Julia Roberts into Garth Brooks, Jack Nicholson into Dr. John. It's awesome. Awesome. I'd say we did okay. Okay, how much time? 90 seconds, guys. You guys don't know the show's live? <laughs> How's New York looking, Rick? Is everybody there? Everybody have a great show. Okay, spot six, you up. 120, 120. Five, you up. Okay. Okay, I don't know if Larry Jordan and everybody can hear me in New York, but have a good show, everybody. Okay, you guys, good luck. Here comes a one minute mark. 13. 12, roll my one count, yeah, 10, okay. Okay, 9, right. 8, 10, 8, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. I was born and raised in New Orleans. It's my hometown. If you've ever been there, you know that New Orleans has a look and a feel and a sound that's all its own. Tonight, let's show people on the Gulf Coast that they have friends all over the world, friends who care, who understand and are here to give them shelter from the storm. Ready to roll. Go to one. Roll. Shelter from the storm. Roll. Take it. Take it. Let me say something. Recently, you uh, need to have these lighting cues so perfect. I want you to have it pre lit. Okay? As soon as the song ends, the home base needs to be lit. I was nurtured and live in the Mississippi Delta. Like all of you, watching Hurricane Katrina's brutal defacement of our Gulf Coast and the tragedy of New Orleans has been difficult to endure. Go to Rod Stewart. Go to Rod Stewart. Here we go. One, five, four, three, okay, two, cue him. one. Cue him. Cue him. Roll A and B on the screen. Boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. Lord have mercy. Just get on board. All you need is faith to get that Jesus humming. Don't need no ticket. You just thank the Lord. All aboard. Get on board. Seven, seven, seven. Jack, thank you so much. Where are you, honey? I what? am in Atlanta, Georgia. I'm from Honduras. Ready, Cameron? I was telling you that. Go, Cameron. Cure. She's on. 33 Among seconds. Among the people on New Orleans Causeway Boulevard, 
A six-year-old boy carried a baby in his arms, away from danger. The boy told relief workers his name was DeMonte Love. The baby was his little brother, and he didn't know where their parents were. Oh, six, South six. Was he thinking about my country or the color of my skin? Was he thinking about my religion? Pretty white. I worshiped him. That's good. South one. When God. Kill George Bush hates midgets. We've all heard the question, why didn't those people just leave when they had the chance? But now we all realize not everyone can jump in their SUVs and go check into a nice hotel. Those people depend on public transportation, and those people can't afford a nice hotel because some of them work there. Well, now is the time for you to do something for them. All across the Gulf Coast, some babies are still separated from their parents. And other one I can begin to provide right now, so please help. Q Ryan, here we go. Please call. Okay, go ahead. Go. One three fifty on the one. One to three, ready Bruce Willis. And three. QM, QM, three, take it. Real courage is when you know you're licked before you begin, but you begin anyway. You see it through no matter what. QM. Take your burdens to the Mardi Gras. Let the music wash your soul. You can mingle in the street. You can jingle to the beat of a jelly roll. The dollars you contribute will go to the American Red Cross and the Salvation Army. In response to this tragedy, the Red Cross has launched the largest mobilization of resources for a single natural disaster in their history. The water's wide. I can cross over. Dancing. You love her dancing, so do I. Yeah. What, do you, here she is. Thanks, Liz. Who am I speaking to? Hi, Hi. who's this? Kelly Messmer. Hey, Kelly, how you doing? I'm great. How about you? I'm good, except for some reason I can't seem to hear my phone, and every time it rings, Jeremy Piven, who's sitting next to me, has to pick it up because I can't hear it. So he's, he's screening every... Yeah, there's a light, and if I was staring at it, I was turned around speaking to someone. In one of the poorer sections of Gulfport, Mississippi, 60... 60 oh, no. Okay, just go. Cue the music. 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 Cue Kanye. Cue Kanye. Cue Kanye. Roll ambient screens. Cue music. Go. Cue Kanye. Music. I don't think I can be that exact. But I'll, uh, go. We're feeding right. back. Right. Cue him. Feeding back. Cue 
eating bag, ready to go to package. No, Stand by package. Not. You have a package. Kill him! I've got the veto. Killed. Okay, we're cued. No, 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 no leave it. Fucking unbelievable. Yeah. Garson is ready. Stay wide, don't try again. Are they hearing it? Garson is ready. You know what the Midwest is, young and restless for restless. Might snatch your necklace and next these might jack your Lexus. Somebody tell these who Kanye West is. I walk through the valley of the shower where death is. Top floor, if you alone and leave you breathless. Try to catch it. It's kind of hard getting choked by detectives. Yeah, and I check the method. They asking us questions, harass and arrest us. Rental car from Avis. My mama used to say only Jesus could save us. Well, mama, I know I act a fool. Got a flood, now we got to move. I hope God showed me the way because the devil's trying to break me down. The only thing that I pray is that my feet don't fail me now. And I don't think there's nothing that I could do to right my wrongs. The only thing that I pray is that my feet don't fail me now. Black the screens. Ready to cue Julia Roberts? Ready three? Cure. Cure. Take three. Cure. Right now, Americans are opening their doors to families who they've never met, to people who never thought they'd find themselves hopeless. Jazz, Mississippi blues are beautiful and profound expressions of the human spirit. I got no time for talking, just got to keep on walking. New Orleans is my home, that's the reason that I'm gone. I'm walking to New Orleans. It's fucking perfect. Wow, yeah. there you go. Stung out. That's incredible. Yeah, what a plan. Watch your pull off here. Okay, we're going to run up there. Thank you. It was great. Well, Once it got going, TBS it is. Thank you. Yes, sir. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Absolutely. Thanks nice for working with you, too. Oh, man. Thank you, sir. Yeah. <laughs> you did a nice job. I need to fix. The, I need to fix two things. Just Ellen and the freeze frame of you too. I think people understand it's live TV. I think that there were other there were other fuck ups before that. Believe me, I opened up on Ellen DeGeneres' legs to open the show. I mean, uh, Ray Romano had the guys walking behind him while he was talking. It was it, it was an imperfect show. The uh, and, and U2's thing wasn't perfect. It was there was like six or seven technical glitches even before we got to Kanye. Um, it, it's it's a, it's it, to me it's a miracle we even got it on the air uh, uh, with, with the little bit of rehearsal that we had today. All right. Thanks yes, for helping. Thank you so much. My pleasure. Girl. My pleasure. Thanks for, Thanks for us. Beautiful packages. You said you're fucking amazing. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. We all knew that. Yeah. It's the best thing in the world. Yeah. Thank you, man. Thank you for doing this. I'm from the Gulf Coast. Oh, you are? So I was able to Do you help have friends out. Friends and relatives are. Yeah, my affected? family's still there. I'm actually going on Wednesday. I'm so, so sorry. Are they okay though? Are they, are they right. on the road um, to recovery? Good job. Great show. That's a great show. Hi, Shelby Boyd Fox. Perfect show. Nice to meet you. Done. Your voice over at night. <laughs> Thank you. Night. Great work. Congratulations. This was great. It was amazing. Okay, maybe time to turn the camera off. What do you think? Whenever you're ready, my friend. I think that's a wrap.